Hello everybody, thanks for watching Nick's shooting channel. We're out at the range and shot our Sig Mosquito 22 long rifle today. Uh, first thing you can see, I just want to show you there's no rounds in the chamber. The chamber is clear, so we have a safe firearm. We have a magazine here, no rounds in the magazine. So um, I did some videos before kind of complaining about how picky this firearm was on ammo, but I've been shooting it a lot recently with the CCI Mini Mag, and it actually has been working out pretty well. So um, anyway, you can check out those other videos, but today we're going to go through and we're going to do a cleaning on this firearm. So uh, first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to take this takedown lever here and we're just going to rotate that uh, forward. And then what we're going to do is we're going to just let this slide um, go forward and it's going to come off like, like so. So you have your firearm here um, with the barrel stays attached. You have your slide, your slide spring. Uh, one thing to notice though, this spring has two different diameters, so when we go to put it back on, the thinner diameter needs to go towards the uh, handle of the firearm. So you don't want the big, big end going this way, small end this direction. So I'm just going to set this here for a minute, and I think if you've watched some of my other videos, you know I use Ballastol to clean all my firearms. It's a cleaner, lubricant protecting all in one. So I'm going to start off, I'm just going to spray a little bit right down the barrel, and just kind of let that sit there for a minute. We'll let that sit right there. Now I'm going to take some cotton or some swabs and all my cleaning videos um, I just do real briefly uh, for the sake of time of the video so you might want to spend a little more time just cleaning off all the carbon, all the crud that you see. Um, but we're just going to wipe down anywhere on the firing pin. You can see here already how, how black and dirty that is. Just anywhere where you can see any unspent uh, gunpowder, any residue, carbon, you just want to get that all nice and clean. Usually what I do is I'll wipe it down first with a little bit of oil, then I'll take a dry rag and just get off some of the excess oil. You want it lubricated, but you don't want gobs of oil sitting on there. So um, just a nice light coat. And you can see here again how black we got this. And we only shot maybe around 100 rounds with this, so not, not too many. So one other thing here on this, and, and I'm not sure exactly, and I've watched a few videos, but there's this little hole right here, and there's some mechanical parts in here. So usually um, I'll just take in just a real small dab of, uh, of oil in there, and uh, you can kind of see it coming out the sides here. So um, just wipe all that down. And again, in all my cleaning videos, what I say is this is how I do it. This is the materials I use. There's probably a thousand different ways to clean a firearm. Um, and you know this works for me so I'm not claiming that this is the best perfect perfect way but uh, it seems to work real good for me and it's the method that I use. So all right, now that we got that cleaned um, we're gonna go back to the barrel and I think you've seen that I use a bore snake and what a bore snake is you just basically run this through the bore it starts off here if you can see and there's uh, might be a little hard to see but there's some real uh, prickly bristles here that'll kind of break stuff up and then as it runs through uh, the, the cloth will get the rest of the oil out. So I'm just going to take and run this through a few times. Just run it through just like this. Some people like using the rod. They say the rod does a little bit better, but um, this is so convenient. It's so quick. It's all one shot. Um, just kind of run this through here. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to look down uh, at some light and just make sure <coughs> it's nice and shiny. I don't see anything on the inside. Next thing I'm going to do is just this feed ramp right here. Um, I'm going to try to get this nice and clean and shiny. And that's the ramp that kind of uh, feeds the next round in when you're shooting. Again, you can see here that I got some of that uh, carbon on spent gunpowder there. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is uh, just these small areas here where the slide runs, I'm just going to put a nice little coat of uh, ballastol there, and then we're just going to wipe things down. Okay. And so now what I'm going to do is take some dry rags and we're just going to 
kind of get all this excess oil off. Like I said, you want to get you want to get it uh, lubricated, but you don't want gobs of oil remaining on there. Just anywhere where you can see that unspent carbon gunpowder, and we'll, we'll wipe down the barrel here and the crown of the barrel, the muzzle. Okay, so this is basically uh, basically clean. So we're going to do now, um, and remember, small side of the spring. So you're going to put your uh, guide rod in here. And um, let me just real quick wipe this back down again here. The dry rag. Okay, so we're going to take this guide rod and we're going to stick it down here on the slide. Actually, let me do it this way. Sorry, let me get my uh, good hand here. I'm going to put this spring in here. And then our slide is going to go in here. You're just going to kind of have to work it back until you get it, uh, get the barrel through the hole on the slide. There you go. And you just kind of work. You got to get that hammer back. Once this is done, you just flip this back. And I'm going to take my gloves off now because I got all kinds of oil on them. Usually I'll get a dry uh, shop towel. And we'll just wipe the outside of the firearm down. And we'll just work that slide a few times. Make sure it's going nice and good. And that's uh, cleaning the Sig Mosquito. Like I said, shooting the CCI Mini Mag recently. I haven't had too many problems. Just stay away from any other ammo. I'm really starting to appreciate uh, firing, firing this 22 long rifle. Want to take, thank you for watching Nick's Shooting Channel. You can check out the website www.nickshootingchannel.com and uh, feel free to subscribe, like the video, leave comments, and pass the word along. Have a nice day.